currently there are good and effective treatments for schizophrenia, but frankly they're not good and effective enough. One of the neurobiological studies that is being led by Professor Cindy Shannon Weikert is to explore possible inflammatory or immune related mechanisms that may be responsible for this disorder in a substantial se section of people with schizophrenia. The importance of this is that we know that there uh, are in anti-inflammatory agents that can assist in improving the symptoms of schizophrenia when taken in association with antipsychotic medication. Professor Scholl is conducting research into individuals who are at clinical high risk of schizophrenia trying to identify the means by which they can be more accurately characterised and thereby improve our predictive power so that treatments can be targeted uh, at those individuals who are indeed at the highest risk of developing schizophrenia. In the epidemiology domain, myself, Kristen Lawrence, Melissa Green and others are conducting a study of children trying to identify profiles in the population of children that reflect risk for schizophrenia or indeed protection against the development of schizophrenia. In order to do better we need to conduct further research and we can't do that without your support either through participation in the research or through generous donations. <laughs>